Good day guys, good day to you all. Welcome back to the Formula Sports channel. Thanks for being here. As always, the support is much appreciated. Gentle reminder to knock up like button, subscribe and share. Free and easy ways to support the channel. We're talking about one Dujan Whisper Richards. A player that has immense potential, right? A player that I have a lot of time for, right? This boy has tremendous potential. The Utiaga busway is a matter of when rather than if, and it's a matter of just how far he can go within this footballing world. It's a matter of how good this boy becomes, right? But a player that I have a lot of time for, undoubtedly a very, very good, extremely talented player, right? Extremely talented player, no doubt about it. But I want to do this video because, and this is not aimed at Dujan Whisper Richards. This is more aimed at fans of Jamaican football. Seeing many of whom are very upset that Dujan Whisper Richards has not made the squad for the upcoming Cameroon friendly, right? And, and that is the main issue at hand in this particular video. Many Jamaican football fans are very upset that Whisper has not made the Cameroon team, right? Many of them feel he should have made the team, right? And as a matter of fact, I even hear fellow vloggers advocating for Whisper being in the national team, you know? Big up to Orion LFC. Seen? But me personally, I respectfully and humbly disagree, right? As I said, the boy has tremendous potential. Only a fool will doubt it, right? However, the issue at play is, uh, for me personally, is schoolboy footballers. Players, in my humble opinion, who are proven only at the schoolboy level must not be making the national team. This is my humble opinion. If you disagree with it, no problem. Hit me in the comment section. Let me know what you think, right? Players who are only proven at the school boy football level have no business making the national team, in my humble opinion, right? And I'm not speaking about age. This has nothing to do with age. If a player at 15 years old is good enough to make the national team and proven to be at that level to warrant an opportunity in the national team, I have no problem with said player making the national team. However, players who are proven, listen to what I'm saying, players who are proven only at the schoolboy level, whether it's Dujan with Richards, whether it's any other player, have no business being in the national senior team. Even if they might tear up the schoolboy football level, as is the case with Dujan Whisper Richards, I am of the opinion that that is not sufficient enough to warrant a player being selected in the national senior team. I'm not talking about the youth teams. I'm talking about the national senior team, right? This boy Dujan Whisper Richards, undoubtedly extremely talented the boy's time will come there's no doubt about it the boy's time will come it's a matter of when rather than if and i'm sure when that time comes he will take it with both hands right this boy nine out of ten chances would more than likely be good enough probably even before his teenage years are up to make the national team not only good enough but has done enough, would have done enough to warrant a selection. The schoolboy football level is an extremely low level of competition. Schoolboy footballers are players that are only proven at the schoolboy football level have no business playing international football. And I think international football is a clown show. And I think international football is a joke. Whisper is an amateur, a very talented boy, but an amateur. Don't tell me about JPL friendlist 
um, friendly games against JPL teams, right, and youth teams in Europe that he would have played. Those are not competitive fixtures. And, like, don't tell me about friendlies against JPL teams. That's not a competitive fixture. That is not consistent, competitive, sustained football. Whisper is only proven at the schoolboy football level. JPL players, top quality. And when I say top quality, I mean relative to the JPL level. The best of the best in the JPL have played international football and have struggled, much less a player only proven at the schoolboy football level playing international football, which credible national team you see selecting players that are only proven at the schoolboy football level, that have only plied their trade consistently at a schoolboy football level? Which national team, which credible national team? Whisper has a lot of potential. The boy will eventually be ready, no doubt about it. But right now, to select Whisper on the basis of what he has done in schoolboy football, it shows the level at which, or it shows the, the maturity of Jamaican football fans with the greatest of respect. For many of them to be trying to make a case for Whisper to make the national senior team. And that is why I said this video is directed at the fans. We must not get caught up in hype. Schoolboy football is more hype than substance. I don't know how I feel about schoolboy football already. Right? Watch it. Want to see the players coming through? Who is the next big thing within the Jamaican context? Sure. But for us to assign that amount of value to school or to ascribe that amount of value to schoolboy football to think that a player dominating at that level is ready for international football? Come on, fans, we have to do better than that. We must not get caught up in hype. Schoolboy football is more hype than substance. Players proven only at a schoolboy football level have not proven themselves at any credible level, much less to be making the national team or being seriously considered for the national team. Look. I know this precedent has been set in the past. Schoolboy footballers in the past have made the national team. In my humble opinion, that is a dangerous precedent and a foolish precedent to have been set. It is not a precedent that we should wish to continue. It is not a precedent that we should be continuing. Straight up, we should decide I do not want to see players only prove not the schoolboy football level making the national team. I'm not talk the senior team. I'm not talking about players who play in both the schoolboy football and also the JPL. That's a different argument entirely. I'm talking about players like a whisper who has only proven themselves consistently at the schoolboy football level. As I said, Whisper, undoubtedly an extremely talented boy, the boy will go on to do big things. I don't doubt it. I have a lot of time for this player. Extremely talented. Nobody can make a case to me that just because he's dominating schoolboy football, he's ready for international football. I don't care how good a player is doing at the schoolboy football level. They could be walking through schoolboy football. What a player has done, mainly in schoolboy football, should not be considered for national team selection. Should not be a criteria 
for consideration for a national senior team call. Seen? That's my two cents. Hit me up in the comment section. Let me know what you guys think. Seen? I want to hear your, your, your thoughts on this particular issue. Take care. Stay safe. Knock up the like button. Subscribe and share. And until next time.